The brand new Halloween event in Pet Simulator X is finally here, guys. And look at all this brand new stuff that they added. First of all, we have this island over here. We head over to this Halloween event door. Let's walk right in. And bam, it's a brand new world. Here, we have spooky upgrades and even this new egg. Now, if you guys are wondering, how do you actually get this candy currency that will allow you to get all of these new eggs? Well, all you have to do is break coins. I already got 20,000 and now 263,000. Oh my gosh, I have like a million now. If I'm getting that much from just a spawn world, I wonder how much I would get from like, maybe like the pixel world or is it the same amount? Let's see. 455 million. That is broken. That is so pee. Oh my gosh, I literally have billions now. I literally just grinded these so quickly. Okay, what happens if we break the chest over here? We break the chest, how many candies am I getting? I got billions for breaking the chest. Billions, I say. So the best area is to go over to this pixel vault over here and start mining the chest with a few of your friends. I am literally, I got one billion candies from breaking this chest at the very end. It is literally the most OP place to go and then you'll get a bunch of these candies. Now that we have eight billion candies, which I don't know about you, but I think that that is quite a bit. Let's head over to the Halloween event. As you can see, to get some of these eggs, even the major egg over here, you only need one million candies. So I think Preston might have messed up a little bit with the code by making these candies incredibly easy to get. Let's open one of these eggs right now, this one million egg. Vampire bat. Oh my gosh, guys, that's one of the new items. Let's see, is it good? 490 million, not bad, not bad. Let's see, let's open another one. Another vampire bat. That's the most common one. I wanna get something good. I wanna get one of the OP pets. More vampire bats. This is sad. Finally, a werewolf. Okay, so that's the next one up there. That's the 14%, let's see that. 840 million, why does it look like it's made of chocolate like this guy? I guess there is technically a chance of getting a huge pet. So that's what is pretty good about this. Plus, some of the old items from back at the very beginning. So you remember the last Halloween event? They had some of the old pets, like like this guy, the uh, gold horse, I think it was called, or this like Grim Reaper guy. They're back. Now, besides all of this, there is one more thing of the Halloween world that I mentioned at the very beginning, but never actually checked out fully. So that is the spooky upgrades. And I noticed this on somebody else's pet, but basically you can upgrade your pet only limited time during this event. Over here, you see the spooky upgrades, and you keep the upgrades even after the event ends. Now, this is more storage, mythical pet chance, more candy, more diamonds, better re-enchants, and all of that. So let's go and upgrade everything right here because it is pretty cheap. So let's go and upgrade all of this. All right, mythical pet chance. Oh man, we can upgrade all of that for sure. Yeah, these spooky upgrades are pretty good. Oh my gosh, this is like cheap. Yeah, I want more candy, more diamonds. Yeah, I need more diamonds. I like those diamonds. Better re-enchants. Do revive all of these so quickly. Legendary pets chance. Yeah, there we go. Let's buy this. Yeah, I'm clicking faster than I can uh, detect my clicks. All right, there we go. And we just got all the spooky upgrades. Now, I recommend that you guys try to go get all these spooky upgrades because remember that you can only get them during this time. And these upgrades save even after the event ends. That'll be it for today's video. Of course, I'll be keeping you updated on everything going on in the Halloween event. And of course, anything you guys want to know, let me know in the comments. Make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and I'll be seeing you all next time. Bye!